Happy Women's Day, my dear lady. This is a special day for women all over the world. Yet, how many of us actually do celebrate? How many of us are in a place where celebration is really possible? I usually don't like positive discrimination or special holidays. Yet, at the end of the day, one has to admit that this is making a difference. In so many places of this world, women are still not equal to men, including from a social status or a salary status or even having their total freedom on their own body and actions. The only way to keep moving forward is to make some space to keep bringing the attention to it and act in the direction of the change. Because I was blessed to be born into a society where those things or those differences did not exist, I always felt that Women's Day were, you know, a little exaggerated or forced. Yet, maybe, just maybe, that was the reason why things were better on this aspect. Like always in this podcast, I love to highlight things that are possible, that do not require tons of money or very advanced skills or competencies, but things that are available for any of us. It is the way we put our attention and focus that changes our perspective and open new opportunities. Today, I took a walk and felt blessed during such a great spring morning. Flowers all over, beautiful smell, birds singing, the sky of a perfect blue. It feels like the entire nature is simply happy. No money spent, no energy spent, only pure enjoyment of life. While walking, I had this powerful realization of all the women who have walked this road before me and what an amazing, beautiful life I do have. And I had a deep, thankful thought for the most beautiful ladies I have in my life and how much I have received from them. Now it is also my turn to add into that foundation of a better tomorrow for any, any little girl to have a life at least as beautiful as mine it is. So providing today you feel sad or lonely or simply too busy to take a moment to celebrate, I want you to know that you are loved and appreciated and I am so deeply honored that you are listening to this right now. And I will also like to share um, some secrets with you, secrets that I have learned from the most important and inspirational women in my life. And hopefully this will give you a hint of how to make this day a day to remember. I will start first with my grandma. My grandma, she's 89 years old today. And she always looks and observes if you go for a walk with her, she will tell you about a specific flower she is seeing. And she will actually go and smell it. She will see a bird looking for food or making its nest. She will tell you to sit with her and watch what is happening. And she will smile. You see, no matter how hard life was for her, and honestly, I don't know if so many people having a life harder than she had, she is still able to simply sit and enjoy and smile. That's the best I have learned from her. And I'm so grateful to have her around. So my darling, take a moment to observe, to sit, to enjoy and smile. Now my mom, my mom would dance no matter where, even when she was cooking, she was singing and dancing. You know, even when she was not able to properly walk any longer, she will dance while sitting on the couch. 
Music and dancing have been part of my life ever since I was born. And I can tell you, nothing, nothing changes the mood faster than the little music. That's the best gift my mother gave me, in addition to her unconditional love. So, you know, we all have good days, bad days, days where we feel a little bit more pain, and days where we feel a little bit more joy. But no matter the days, a little bit of music, it is always available for us, and it's always making a difference, almost in no time. Make sure you have a list of your you know, feel you know, good, feel uh, good uh, music if you want. If you want. Have it somewhere, Have it somewhere near, near to you, near on your phone. Your phone. And, and just put a little bit of music, music on every now and then. Now, no, my dear friend, my dear friend who, is who is also my also coach, coach, she was she teaching was me teaching how to how serve the wave of life. life. She, was she was holding the holding space for me to express my emotions. She has shown me that even when pain is there, and it is unavoidable, suffering, it's optional. So here is the tip. No matter how scary it may look, there is always a place to grow and experience. There is always more options. There is always someone to guide you if you allow yourself to be vulnerable. We are we not are Wonder not Woman. Wonder we, are we are not God. God. We, are we are simply beautiful, beautiful amazing, amazing woman. woman. And that's really and something, that's something to be happy about. Happy about. So remember, remember to allow to yourself allow to be yourself vulnerable. vulnerable. And make and space, space for, someone for someone or something, or something to, guide to guide you. Now my best, now teacher, my best teacher, oh dear, oh, when I was when still I was a teen, still a teen and not clear not yet clear about yet the best about choices the best for my career and where my life will go. go. I had this I had beautiful this lady teacher. teacher. Thanks, thanks to her to devotion her and passion and, passion and belief and in my capabilities, my capabilities. I had I become had the best in my best category in a country in contest. contest. I was I so was proud. proud. But that was but not, that the was not the best. The best is the how best much I did enjoy the topic, how much passion she transmitted to me. Not only about, Not only about what, she was, what teaching, she was teaching, but also about how beautiful how teaching, teaching is. is. I had a great had career, a great and, career. I and I own her, her this. this. She, has she has taught me, taught me the, utility the utility of things, things the, passion the passion in whatever, whatever you, do, you do, and the power, and the power of entrusting a very, a very young, person young person in her way in her to way become an adult. Trust me a little of whatever you have learned in life to a young person that it's about, it's about to start, to start, her, start journey. her journey. Giving, Giving is the best is feeling, the best feeling and, it and it will definitely make your day. Your day. Transmit, Transmit, share, share with, a young, with a young lady. Finally, Finally and definitely and not, the end, not the end, my soulmate, my, soulmate, my, friend, my friend, she looks she at me with, with love, love and genuine and care. care. She holds she me holds and feeds me. Feeds she me. cheers me when she cheers me up cheers when me my up, world when is world it's falling is apart. Falling she tells apart. me, I am so I am proud, of you. proud of you. You are an you amazing, are an amazing strong, strong and beautiful woman. And for some, and for reasons, some reasons, I do, I believe, do her. believe her. Never, never, never underestimate, underestimate the power of a true friendship. friendship. There, is there is nothing more, more valuable, valuable than the human than connection. The human connection. Give, give without expecting, without expecting anything, anything in return, because so many things will simply come back to you. Find a way Find to a simply, way to be, simply be, be with a true lady, true lady friend. friend. That's the best That's way the to best enjoy this enjoy woman, day. woman day. So, so I, know I know any one of you here has a lady friend. friend. Maybe someone Maybe that someone you don't that see, you so much see so much nowadays because, because you know, life, life happens. happens. But when to be honest, there is someone, there is someone at least one, one special lady in your life that you can call, or you can text, where you can just you take can out take for out a coffee or a coffee drink, or whatever, whatever, and enjoy and this enjoy woman this together. together. This woman days so together. Make, together. It make it different. different. Make it make count. It count. 
You see, today I wanted to honor few of the ladies that made a difference in my life and share with you what I have learned from them. And to be completely honest, the list is so much longer. And I owe so much to so many women I have met during this journey. And I know this is far from the end. Like one of the women I admire the most, Maya Angelou said, your crown have been bought and paid for. Put it on your head and wear it. You see? Remember them. Remember who you are. And in this day, celebrate. Celebrate. Walk with that crown on your head because you deserve it. And instead of my traditional homework or, or final thought, I just want you to leave you with this poem from my dear Maya Angelou. I will only read a part of it and definitely encourage you to go and read it again and again in totality and almost like a homework to print it out and put it on your own mirror just to remind you you are a phenomenal woman phenomenal woman by Maya Angelou pretty woman wonder where my secret lies I'm not cute or built to suit a fashion model size but when I start to tell them they think I'm telling lies I say, I say it's in the reach, in the reach of my arms, my arms the, span the span of my hips, of my hips the stride the of, my step, of my step, the curl, the curl of, my of my lips. I am a woman, am a woman phenomenally, phenomenally, phenomenal, phenomenal woman. woman. That's me. That's me. Men, themselves Men themselves have wondered, have wondered what they see in me. me. They try so they try much, so but much, they can they touch my inner my mystery. mystery. When I try when to I show them, they say they still can't see. I say, I say, it's in the it's arch the of arch my, back, my back, the sun of my smile, smile the ride of my breast, my breast, the grace the of my style. My style. I, am I am a woman, phenomenally, phenomenally phenomenal, woman. phenomenal woman. That's me. That's me. Have, Have an amazing, amazing woman, woman day, my dear. Day, my dear. And, remember, and remember, you are, you are a phenomenal, phenomenal woman. woman. Enjoy. Enjoy.